We all know about the ketogenic diet, right? It's been the talk of the town for quite some time now. High fat, very low carb, and promises of quick weight loss. The traditional keto diet is all about loading up on fats like avocados, cheese, and butter while cutting out almost all carbs. But what if you could get those keto benefits without loading up on fat? Imagine enjoying the metabolic advantages of ketosis without having to consume large amounts of fatty foods. That's where low-fat keto comes in. This innovative approach to the ketogenic diet focuses on reducing fat intake while still maintaining the low-carb principles. It's a twist on the classic keto diet that emphasizes lean protein and healthy fats. Instead of relying heavily on fatty cuts of meat and oils, low-fat keto encourages the consumption of lean proteins like chicken, fish, and plant-based options. Think of it as a way to enjoy the benefits of keto while prioritizing your heart health. By incorporating more heart-healthy foods such as salmon, leafy greens, and nuts, you can support cardiovascular health while still reaping the rewards of ketosis. Intrigued? Let's dive deeper into the world of low-fat keto and see what a typical day of eating looks like. From breakfast to dinner, we'll explore delicious and nutritious meal options that fit perfectly into this diet plan. Get ready for delicious meals that are both satisfying and good for you. Whether you're a seasoned keto dieter or new to the concept, low-fat keto offers a fresh perspective on healthy eating. So, stay tuned as we uncover the secrets to making low-fat keto work for you, ensuring you enjoy every bite while staying on track with your health goals. Traditional keto often involves high amounts of saturated fat from foods like butter and fatty meats. Low-fat keto, on the other hand, focuses on lean protein sources like fish, chicken breast, and tofu. Healthy fats are still part of the equation but in moderation. Think avocados, nuts, and olive oil. The benefits of low-fat keto are similar to traditional keto weight loss, improved blood sugar control, and increased energy. However, the lower fat content may be gentler on your heart and cholesterol levels. It's a sustainable approach to keto that can be easily incorporated into a healthy lifestyle. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day and that's no different on a low-fat keto diet. I like to start my day with a protein-packed meal that keeps me feeling full and energized until lunchtime. One of my go-to low-fat keto breakfasts is scrambled eggs with smoked salmon and spinach. I use one whole egg and two egg whites for a boost of protein without too much fat. The smoked salmon adds healthy omega-3 fatty acids, and the spinach provides essential vitamins and minerals. This breakfast is quick, easy, and keeps me satisfied for hours. For lunch, I usually opt for a large salad with grilled chicken or fish. Salads are a great way to load up on vegetables, which are low in carbs and high in fiber. I like to use a variety of leafy greens like spinach kale and romaine lettuce. To make my salad more filling, I add a good source of protein like grilled chicken breast or salmon. I also include a small amount of healthy fats such as half an avocado or a tablespoon of olive oil-based dressing. This keeps me feeling satisfied and prevents energy crashes in the afternoon. Snack Attack Low-fat keto to the rescue. Snacking can be tricky on any diet, but it's especially important to make healthy choices on low-fat keto. I avoid processed snacks and sugary treats. Instead, I opt for snacks that are high in protein and healthy fats. Some of my favorite low-fat keto snacks include a handful of almonds, a hard-boiled egg, or some celery sticks with almond butter. These snacks provide sustained energy and prevent me from feeling overly hungry before dinner. Low-fat keto dinner flavorful and filling. When it comes to maintaining a low-fat keto diet, finding meals that are both flavorful and filling can sometimes be a challenge. However, with a bit of creativity and the right ingredients, you can create dishes that not only satisfy your taste buds, but also keep you on track with your dietary goals. Dinner on a low-fat keto diet is all about lean protein and plenty of non-starchy vegetables. These components are essential because they provide the necessary nutrients without the excess carbs and fats that can derail your progress. Lean proteins like chicken, turkey, and fish are excellent choices, while non-starchy vegetables such as spinach, broccoli, and bell peppers add volume and nutrients to your meals. I love to experiment with different flavors and cuisines. Incorporating a variety of spices and herbs can transform a simple dish into a culinary masterpiece. For instance, adding a touch of garlic, lemon, and dill to your salmon can elevate its flavor profile, making it a delightful experience for your palate. One of my favorite low-fat keto dinners is baked salmon with roasted asparagus and a side of cauliflower rice. This combination is not only delicious but also incredibly nutritious. The salmon provides a rich source of protein and healthy fats, while the asparagus and cauliflower rice offer a low-carb alternative to traditional sides. Salmon is an excellent source of protein and omega-3 fatty acids. 
These essential fats are known for their anti-inflammatory properties and their ability to support heart health. When selecting salmon, opt for wild-caught varieties as they tend to have higher levels of omega-3s compared to farmed salmon. Asparagus is a low-carb vegetable that is packed with nutrients. It is rich in vitamins A, C, and K, as well as folate and fiber. Roasting asparagus brings out its natural sweetness and adds a delightful crunch to your meal. Simply toss the spears in a bit of olive oil, season with salt and pepper, and roast until tender. Cauliflower rice is a great low-carb alternative to traditional rice. It is incredibly versatile and can be seasoned in a variety of ways to complement any dish. To make cauliflower rice, simply pulse cauliflower florets in a food processor until they resemble rice grains, then saute in a bit of oil until tender. This meal is both delicious and satisfying. The combination of flavors and textures makes it a joy to eat, and knowing that it aligns with your dietary goals adds an extra layer of satisfaction. Plus, the high protein content helps keep you full and energized throughout the evening. It's a perfect way to end a day of healthy eating on the low-fat keto plan. By incorporating meals like this into your routine, you can enjoy a variety of delicious foods while staying committed to your health and wellness goals. Remember, the key to success on any diet is finding balance and making choices that you can sustain in the long term. Low-fat keto in a nutshell, putting it all together. So there you have it. We've journeyed through the essentials of the low-fat keto diet, and now it's time to see how it all comes together in your daily life. That's a glimpse into a day of eating on a low-fat keto diet. From breakfast to dinner, and even snacks in between, each meal is an opportunity to fuel your body with the right nutrients. Remember, the key is to focus on lean protein sources, healthy fats in moderation, and plenty of non-starchy vegetables. Lean proteins like chicken breast, turkey, and fish are excellent choices. And don't forget the vegetables. Non-starchy vegetables like spinach, broccoli, and bell peppers are packed with vitamins and minerals and they add volume to your meals without adding many calories. It's about finding a balance that works for you and your body. Everyone's nutritional needs are different, so it's important to listen to your body and adjust your diet accordingly. Low-fat keto is not about deprivation. It's about making smart choices that nourish your body and support your health goals. You can still enjoy a variety of delicious foods while staying within your dietary guidelines. It's about making smart choices that nourish your body and support your health goals. Fresh, whole foods should be the cornerstone of your diet. Think about the quality of the food you're eating, not just the quantity. With a little planning and creativity, you can enjoy delicious and satisfying meals while reaping the benefits of this way of eating. Meal planning can help you stay on track and ensure you have healthy options available at all times. You can enjoy delicious and satisfying meals while reaping the benefits of this way of eating. Remember, the goal is to create a sustainable eating pattern that you can maintain in the long term. So, experiment with different recipes, find what you love, and make this diet your own. Your turn conquering keto challenges. Now, I want to hear from you. What are some of the biggest challenges you face when it comes to following a keto diet, especially a low-fat version? Let me know in the comments below. Sharing your experiences can help others on their own journeys. We're in this together and I'm here to offer support and guidance along the way. Macros your guide on the low-fat keto journey. Let's talk about macros, short for macronutrients. They are the building blocks of your diet protein, carbohydrates, and fats. On low-fat keto, you're aiming for a specific ratio of these macros to keep your body in a fat-burning state called ketosis. Figuring out your ideal macro targets can feel a bit like solving a puzzle at first, but there are plenty of online calculators and resources available to help you determine the right amounts for your body and goals. Meal prep your secret weapon for low-fat keto success. Let's face it, life gets busy. Having prepped meals ready to go can be a game-changer when you're following low-fat keto. It helps you stay on track and resist those tempting takeout menus. Dedicate a couple of hours each week to batch cooking some staples like grilled chicken breasts, roasted vegetables, and cauliflower rice. Portion them out into containers, and you'll have grab-and-go meals ready throughout the week. Listen to your body. Adjusting portions on low-fat keto. Remember, everyone is different. What works for one person on low-fat keto might not work for another. Pay attention to your body's cues and adjust your portion sizes accordingly. If you're feeling overly hungry, don't be afraid to add a bit more protein or healthy fats to your meals. On the other hand, if you're feeling satisfied with smaller portions, that's perfectly fine too. The key is to find what makes you feel your best.